An update on the latest play in the World Chess Championships in half an hour on BBC Two. First, for one of Pop's most enduring personalities, tonight's star prize, a trip to DJ Heaven. <laughs> On DJ Heaven tonight, Shocking Blue, Limmy and the Family Cooking, Golden Earring, The Undertones, Eddie Grant, Joe Jackson, The Selector, The Teardrop Explodes, and of course, Jimmy Savile. Jimmy Savile! Name, Sir James Wilson Vincent Savile, OBE. Born 1926 in Bevan, Leeds. Son of a bookmaker's clerk. The Duchess, as he called his mother, raised her seven children on two pounds a week housekeeping. During wartime, the young Savile was conscripted into the Yorkshire mines. When a pit explosion laid him off work, he edged into the entertainment business, staging the world's first disco in Manchester in the 50s. DJing by night and performing in the ring by day, at one time, he was the highest paid wrestler in the world. Of his 107 professional fights, only one failed to sell out, and that was because of a bus strike. What great British pluck the Savile is showing at the moment. I can see his teeth dropping out one by one. And I think that Savile will welcome the break. I really think he will. Because at the moment, he's had too many breaks. Two arms, one leg and a neck. It wasn't until 1968 that Radio One finally woke up to the talents of the blonde bombshell, and he brought his energetic eccentricity to the airwaves. OK, then, quiet in the studio. Here we go, Jim. And hi there, all you guys and gals. Good morning, good morning, good morning to one and all. It's hoping that you are fit and well that we find you, and after a week of diving around all over the place, here we are back home again with today's edition of Savile's Travels. So, tell you what we do, how's about we go off with a good old oldie for a change? With his distinctive looks and forthright manner, Savile made an easy transition to television and proved that you didn't have to be a teenager to have teen appeal. Herman, now, about, what, three, four months ago, you was getting 30 bob a week, now you're getting about 30,000 pounds a year. How do you feel? Fine. How do you feel? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jimmy Savile! First you see him, then you don't. How about that, then? <laughs> and how about that, though, then? Now, then. As it happens, it's top of the pops. How about that, then? Right, now, then. So, how's about this, then? <laughs> oh, yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Oh. <laughs> Two, three... <laughs> <laughs> Jimmy Savile! Essential accessories from Jimmy Savile's wardrobe include pendants, cigars, shades, headgear, rings, a tracksuit for all occasions, and of course, his trademark blonde hairdo. I won't be able to do a thing with my hair tonight and all that. <laughs> I won't be able to do a thing with this. The combing of the bonnets. The combing of the bonnets. What a way to want to live in. Uh, over there. One more, Jim. One more time. Jim. How about that, then? Uh, Jim's over here now. The OBE. Do you know what the OBE stands for? It stands for, in my case, Old Blondhead. As it happens, I'm the only disc jockey you can recognise from the back as well as the front. Your bloody BBC's the worst of the lot, with the top of the pops and the evil painted youths dressed up like girls, and that middle-aged peroxide albino clunk click punch the gun charging it. If somebody was to hit you with a broken bottle, you'd think they were a maniac. Yet a lot of you risk far worse damage than this every time you get in your car, because a broken windscreen can do far greater damage than a broken bottle, if you're not wearing a seatbelt. <laughs> 
Despite his wayward appearance, the tireless DJ has been at the forefront of many successful public campaigns. He's met the Pope, had tea with the Queen, raised over 30 million pounds for charity. And in addition to Now Then, Now Then, and As It Happens, contributed one other phrase to the English language. Clunk the car door and click the seatbelt. Clunk, click, every trip. But for many, it will be as the very first presenter of the BBC's new popular music programme that Jim will be best remembered. So now sit back as Jimmy Savile leads us through the pop archives of that very show. Top of the Pops. Yes, it's number one. It's Top of the Pops. Now, the very first time, ladies and gentlemen, on Top of the Pops, we have a group here all the way from Dutch Holland, you see. And how about that, then? And it's the, the, the number one in America, the top of the Dutch hit parade and all. And here they are. They're called Shocking Blue.